Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel, Red Elevator. I'm Nina Takish, this is the Red Elevator that you guys recognize. And today we are going to talk about how to make your house look ultra luxurious. I know you've been asking me for this, so let's get into it right now. <laughs> And since so many of you asked me today, I am wearing a gorgeous, and I'd like to give a very special shout out and thank you to Tori Birch for styling me today in this fantastic, very gorgeous, marled top and skirt set from this season. We will link this outfit below so that you guys can also look at it and enjoy. My favorite ways to update and make a room feel extremely luxurious is lighting. You guys know how much I am obsessed with lighting. Lighting can transform a room. We are going to do a deep dive into lighting on another episode where we're gonna talk about you know, recessed lighting, how to use them, what's the difference between LED spotlight, floodlight, but for this, particular episode, I want to talk about ambient lighting, sculptural lighting. As you can see from these photos, these small changes can make a huge impact in your space. You want to be able to bring in pieces that are really fun and interesting and just changing out a lamp, putting a floor lamp, as you can see, has a really fantastic formative and transformative effect. Another great way to literally make your space feel luxurious without doing anything um, is simply to let the natural light in. A lot of people have drapes and curtains and blinds and they tend to forget and leave them down. Open up those drapes, open up the blinds, make your space feel more airy, more luxurious by actually letting in natural light. The second easy and wonderful and even affordable way to make your space look ultra luxurious is to bring in opposite colors. As you can see, I am obsessed with black and white and that is something that will make your house look very crisp, very sharp. So you can have black and white floors, as you can see in these photos, you can have contrasting colors, a juxtaposition of something that is neutral with a pop of color. So bringing in what I would call opposite colors into a space and putting them together, for example, black and gold really has that elevated sense of style. As you can see in all of these photos can really transform your room. So how do you do it? Just buy a contrasting color object, you know, perhaps get this gold statue that you're going to put next to this uh, black object and make it pop. My absolute favorite, I don't know, I have so many favorites, but this is my, probably my favorite is to upgrade your hardware. I have done this. This is like a special secret dupe. You buy a piece that's not that expensive. You throw in some expensive hardware and you have a million dollar look. For example, in my laundry room that I just repainted, I just wanted a fresh look in there. And what I did was I repainted my cabinets and I placed really interesting hardware. As you can see, these marble knobs make a huge difference in this room. It's a small room and these knobs are so fun and so elevated, so unexpected for a laundry room that this makes the room feel really gorgeous. The very next best thing to make your space feel ultra luxe, luxurious, is to bring in a mirror. I know it seems obvious and maybe it's not so obvious, but go to your estate sales, go to a flea market, go into your own garage or your parents' garage, go and find mirrors, they're everywhere. You guys know that I'm an ambassador at Anthropology, Anthro Living, and they gifted me the most gorgeous mirror. I placed it in my family room. I leaned it against the wall in front of an egg chair and the composition of having that beautiful leaned 18th century type mirror with my 50s egg chair is a winning combination. This shows luxury without breaking the bank. A mirror cannot be that expensive if you guys know where to hunt for them. Make sure that they are delicate or the frame is interesting and put them, put them wherever you can. If you can, put them in a vignette. I love leaning them on a credenza with art in front of it and objects in front of it. Again, I love putting it in family rooms and this is definitely something that I recommend. 
You guys know how transformative a rug can be. I just finished a um, partnership with Ruggable. I didn't just finish it. In fact, I designed an entire rug collection with Ruggable. I am standing on one of my own rugs and I can't tell you how much these rugs have transformed my space. These are actually very affordable and they are extremely luxurious. This is how you can get yourself luxury on a dime. In our comment section, we're gonna have a link to all the rugs that I've designed so you can see all the different colors and choices that will definitely unequivocally transform your space. Oversized photography has a transformative effect. I just acquired, and I'm so excited about it, that I, um, I'm shamelessly glowing, gloating, I'm shamelessly gloating about this gorgeous, um, beautiful piece of art, which is a blown up photography from Gino Princena. He's a very famous um, photographer, but what I love about this piece is that it's uh, approximately 75, by say 45 and this piece is stunning take a look at this beautiful photograph of the fontalina hotel in capri this was a beautiful moment in time and the fact that it's on my wall in this grand size is what makes it super luxurious so if you can't think of anything at all, blow up a photo, go take pictures in the nature in wherever you're traveling to and blow it up. The very next best thing that I do every three or four years that absolutely makes my space and me feel exceedingly luxurious, spontaneity, spontaneity, no, spontaneously is, are you guys ready for this? fresh brand new towels and sheets that is my favorite i feel like i'm at a hotel and how easy is it to get fresh towels and sheets i go to marshall's home home goods and i find they have the best towels i have to admit that they literally for nine dollars and 99 cents i find the best towels on the planet right at my fingertips I throw all the old ones out. Actually, I don't actually throw them out. I like to repurpose. I cut them up and we use them for rags. I feel like old towels clean floors really well and shower glass doors. So that's an extra tip that I wanted to share with you. So cut those up, bring in the new fresh towels, fresh, white, clean. And you know, it's worth, it's worth doing it every three, four years and you will transform your bathroom, your life, and your space. Don't forget to subscribe so that you guys get alerted when my new videos are out. I want to thank you guys for being on this journey with me. It means a great deal. Remember, less is more, always in design. And next week, we are going to do something extra special. I'm finally going to introduce my favorite neutral paint colors. I know that you guys have been asking for this and I can't wait to deliver it to you. I love you guys. Thanks for always being here and I'll see you guys again next Sunday on the Red Elevator. And that better not get into the video. That better not end up in YouTube me dancing like that.